This is Insider Medicine in 60 from Chicago. According to research presented by the American Society for Clinical Oncology, those with advanced or metastatic colorectal cancer who also have the gene KRAS will benefit from using the targeted therapy drug Erbitux in combination with chemotherapy. In a study of 540 patients, those receiving Erbitux experienced a 32% lower risk of progression than those that received chemotherapy alone. From Australia, according to a report in the Archives of General Psychiatry, exposure therapy in which a trauma survivor must relive a troubling event may be effective in preventing progression to post-traumatic stress disorder. In a study of 90 patients with acute stress disorder, only 33% of those that received exposure therapy developed PTSD, compared to 63% of those who received cognitive restructuring therapy. And finally, from Boston, new research shows that low levels of vitamin D are common in healthy children. In a study of 380 healthy children aged 8 to 24 months, 12% had a vitamin D deficiency and 32% had evidence of bone mineral loss. The researchers suggest that infants may need to receive vitamin D supplements while breastfeeding, and some may require regular measurements of their vitamin D levels. For Insider Medicine in 60, I'm Dr. Susan Sharma.